Welcome back. If you are experiencing foot pain, getting the right diagnosis and therapy can be the first steps you need to take to find relief. And today we welcome Matt Hall from the Court Tates Creek Clinic with some details on some of the problems that you may be experiencing and a free clinic on how you can get evaluated. Thank you so much for being with us today. Yeah. We'll start with uh, some of the common causes. What are some of the um, contributing factors of folks who are experiencing foot pain? Well, oftentimes it's a change in footwear. It could be aging process. Um, additional weight gain during the holidays. Mm -hmm. A lot of people being on their feet and doing more shopping and new shoes. Um, repetitive motion type injuries, uh, improper training techniques. Uh, runners, we see a lot of runners getting back to the sport that haven't been there for a while. They'll actually start experiencing some foot pain among other causes. And once you kind of figure out what's going on, where does it go from there? What are some of the options that folks have for therapy and uh, relieving the pain? Sure. After we do an assessment on each patient, we'll actually come up with a treatment plan for those folks. And sometimes it will involve, obviously, exercise, sometimes hands-on manual therapy techniques. Um, we do have some of our clinicians certified in a technique called ASTEM, which is using some tool evaluation tools and treatment tools to actually treat these chronic conditions. Um, oftentimes it may lead to orthotics or some other types of interventions that we may need to include as well. And um, it's interesting, you mentioned that weight gain and obesity can be an issue with uh, foot pain. Obviously, if your feet are hurting, that's not going to encourage you to exercise more in most cases. So no, it's, you've no, got to figure not. out what's going on, right? Sure, sure. And a lot of times, you know, we will try to intervene with some pain management techniques. Um, we do have aquatics therapy, and oftentimes patients are appropriate to intervene there as well or to try those interventions. And, uh, you know, again, the orthotics or taping techniques and other things can alleviate the pain more. Uh, suddenly then maybe waiting for the techniques or the, waiting for the uh, condition itself to resolve. And you guys have a free clinic coming up where folks can come in and get an evaluation. Tell us about that. Sure. For the rest of the month in uh, all the area court clinics we do have the, uh, the uh, free foot screening clinic and you can contact any of our clinics for that and also go to our website and we can actually list the clinicians that are certified in delivering the ASTEM technique if that's something that you're interested in doing or talking to the clinicians about. All right. Well, thank you so much for being with us and sharing uh, this, this medical information. As he mentioned, if you're interested in that free clinic, it's running through the rest of this month. And you see the number for court and their website listed there at the bottom of your screen. And you'll find Matt at the Court Tates Creek Clinic. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you. We will be right back with a check of your forecast. Mary Wasson tells us why it may be a white Christmas after all. And we're not just talking about the snow that's still sticking around out there that hasn't melted yet. Well, that's right. You know, today we had some snow showers this morning. We're tracking another storm later this week, Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. I'll show you that full seven day here in a few minutes.